Managing the risks of AI systems. Why is AI so promising for business? A big part of the appeal of AI systems is that they tend to be more powerful and more flexible than other technology systems we're familiar with. This means that AI systems can tackle problems that other technology systems can't solve. The same technological features also make them less predictable and more difficult to understand than regular IT systems. This means that most businesses' IT governance approaches aren't robust enough to ensure that they are developing, buying or using AI systems responsibly. Let's think about what you need to consider before using AI systems in your business. You already know it's important to ensure that an application is cyber secure and that it isn't in breach of your privacy policy. But are you sure that your pre-trained AI system will continue to perform equally well a year from today? Are you confident that it won't produce dangerous outputs or cause harm? Are you certain that it isn't inadvertently breaching human rights? Because AI systems are often used in ways that can have big impacts for your stakeholders, business leaders need to be across these kinds of questions. If not, you might find your organisation exposed to significant commercial, reputational and regulatory risks. So let's look at the risks more closely. Commercial risks occur when poor AI system performance leads to extra cost. Ill-suited system design and security weaknesses can cost you time and money. For example, many AI systems are trained on data that becomes less relevant over time. If the training data isn't updated, the system will not be fit for purpose. Reputational risks can be even more concerning. Only 34% of Australians say they are willing to trust AI systems. This means you need to be extra careful that your systems are designed and implemented ethically and responsibly. If a system is found to have biased results, or is found to mislead or manipulate, this can severely damage your brand. If you are relying on automated decisions that aren't explained well, you may be at risk of the same reputational damage. Finally, AI systems can create regulatory risks. Australia has a range of laws covering consumer rights, employee safety and data privacy, to name a few, that apply to your use of AI in the same way they apply to any other product or process in your business. If you're not managing the risks associated with AI, you might mislead customers or endanger workers and be in breach of Australian law. An improper use of data could be in breach of privacy law, while a biased AI system could produce decisions that are in breach of discrimination law. Commercial risk, reputational risk and regulatory risks often arise at the same time. Imagine that a group of doctors in a general practice implement an AI system that helps them diagnose illnesses and recommend treatment plans. Initially, the system seems to work well. It makes it far easier for doctors to access detailed patient histories, take notes and advise on treatment options. It gives GPs more time to focus on connecting with patients. However, over time, a few doctors notice an unsettling trend. Despite the AI system not having access to records of patients' ethnicity, it appears to be systematically recommending a set of expensive, private treatments to people of a certain ethnicity at far higher rates than other groups. This situation presents all three types of risk. By disproportionately recommending more expensive treatments in this way, the clinic risks driving away patients without private health insurance. When it becomes public knowledge that the clinic relies on an AI system that produces racially biased results, the clinic's reputation would be damaged. Lastly, this type of bias puts the clinic in breach of Australian discrimination law and medical ethics, exposing the doctors to claims of professional misconduct. An AI initiative that began as a technological advancement has now become a costly mistake. So how can you ensure that these risks don't materialise for your organisation? The human-centred approach is to start by focusing on harms and linking these to risks that may arise later. Harms are real, tangible negative impacts to people. They can range from small inconveniences to serious life-threatening consequences. Responsibly managing AI system risk means first thinking carefully through the potential harms that can result from the systems you use, then implementing strategies that avoid these harms. 
This is true whether you're using AI to analyze data, summarize research, draft legal contracts, operate machinery, recommend a product, or respond to your customers online. After all, it's only once you understand the potential harms that you can develop controls to prevent them from occurring. In the next video, we will explore how you can do this in ways that make sure your AI system delivers.